So when you go to a museum and you're in front of a painting with your kids, you want to ask some basic questions after you have read whatever is hanging by the painting that tells you the artist, the medium, the year, and the title. So the first thing you want to do is say, what is the title of this artwork? Does that title give you any clues? So the title of this painting is Surprised, Tiger Surprised by a Storm. Well, that tells us right there, it's a tiger surprised by a storm. So then ask the question, what are some key things you see in the painting? Your kids might answer a tiger, a lot of trees, a jungle, some lightning. Talk about the elements in the painting. Then you want to ask the question, how does this painting make you feel? and encourage kids to use language that describes that they're scared, that they feel tense, or that they feel excited, or it's very calm. Another question you're going to want to ask is, where does your eye go first? What do you look at? What is the focal point? Because it will be different for every child. For example, your eye is naturally drawn to the tiger. That's a key element in this painting. But some kids' eye might be drawn to these red flowers. Ask them why. It's probably that bright, intense color. Or another child might be drawn to the lightning. If you're struggling with what types of paintings to take your kids to see, think of things that kids naturally like. Animals, people, other children, games. And by looking at the catalog that the museum gives you, you can find certain paintings that all have that theme or that subject matter. Animals being a really big one that kids are really drawn to. Don't be intimidated by how many paintings are in the museum. Only focus on a few. Don't try to see it all. Try and see what the kids will really respond to. Things like animals, other kids, toys or games, or unique places. Another great thing for when you visit an art museum is to tie it to history. So much of art is a representation of history at that time. So if you're studying something in particular in history, try to go and see those paintings from that time period. That's the key to having a successful art museum trip with kids.